Hello there, I'm Alex, it's my day in the life as a pediatric travel nurse, and this is Winston right here, say hi! So if you don't know what a travel nurse is, basically I'm a nurse, but I travel. So I go from hospital to hospital three months at a time, and I do a contract there, and I go somewhere else. With all that said, it does sound complicated because you're constantly moving, but with how much you're getting paid and you get to see the whole world, it's kind of worth it. Tonight we're working in the pediatric ER, and I'm on night shift now, so it's about 4 o'clock, and we're going to get ready for our 7 a.m. shift. I don't know about you guys, but I love being on night shift. I feel like I have so much more time in the day than I do on day shift because right now I'm going to go work out, which is crazy. I never work out before work. People on day shift will go work out before the 7 a.m. shift. Nope, that's not me. I don't know how people wake up that early or let alone go to the gym afterwards. And you can see the time there. It's almost 5 o'clock. So usually I'm at the house by 6.15. So we got plenty of time. And I always take these before I work out because I'm always fasting when I wake up. I don't know about you guys, but I just can't eat when I wake up. Like, I am not a breakfast person, so something like this gets me through the day, and then usually around lunch and dinner, I'm hungry again, which is technically around like 2 a.m. for me now. So basically for my workout schedule, I do three days of heavy lifting and like two days of cardio, circuit training, which I'm doing today, just so I feel healthy because I just hate doing cardio. Basically right now I'm doing 10 pull-ups, 10 push-ups, and 10 kettlebell squats for 10 minutes straight. My last apartment had a Peloton, and let me tell you, it's the real deal. It was awesome. So my camera died during my workout, but I promise you, I did the whole workout. And right now, I'm gonna make a protein shake and have a shower and get into my scrubs. So I'm gonna do a cool transition here, and here are my scrubs in three, two, one. And just like that, we're in scrubs. So I do wear figs, I'm not sponsored, but they're so nice, they're so comfortable. I can stretch, I can kick, I can do anything in these scrubs. They're seriously pretty awesome. When I was a new grad, I got bullied for wearing figs because I don't think these well-fitting scrubs were a thing back then, but now they're more well-known. If anyone out there bullies you for what you wear at work, don't listen to them. And every day before I leave for work, I gotta hug this guy because he literally would not get off my shoulder. Like, he wants all the hugs in the world and he wants all the love before I leave because I'm his whole world. <laughs> And you can see right now how dark it is. And I don't know about you guys, but whenever I get to my car, I like to sit here for like five to 10 minutes and just meditate because I know when I walk into work, it's gonna be crazy. Because right now the pediatric world is on fire. Everyone has RSV and flu, it's just nuts. And because I work in the ER, I work some weird hours. So right now I'm going in at 7 p.m., but I don't get off at 7 a.m., I get off at 3 a.m. So it's an eight hour shift. So you're gonna see me when it's still dark outside. And I will see you guys after work. Hopefully I can get some clips and I'll put it in here for the video if it doesn't really bother me at work, but we'll see. All right, I'm back from work now and that was crazy. Yep, just as I expected, it was really insane. And we just did a lot of IVs, blood cultures, blood work, EKGs, monitoring, all that stuff. But thankfully no one got you know, intubated or transferred out. We all got them discharged, so it was a good day. But um, yeah, it was just another crazy day in the ER right now. And I wish I could show you more, but um, hopefully as I make more of these, I can um, kind of, you know, bring some things along with me and show you. But guys, if you like these videos, let me know. I have no idea what kind of videos I make right now on YouTube. This is my very first one. So if you like day in the lives or vlogs or just kind of sit down talking videos, let me know because I will read every single one of your comments, all your DMs, all of the guys. Trust me, I read it all because I don't know what I'm doing right now. And this is all new to me, but you know, if you stick around, hopefully we can build something cool here. But thanks for watching guys. I appreciate all you guys. It's my first time filming this kind of stuff. So hopefully in the next video, it'll be a lot better. So see you later.